have you ever wanted to put this and this together? Probably not, but if you did, you came to the right video. Fortnite is that one thing that everyone and their grandma knows, and so is VR, so how about you put them together? It should be a good mix, right? No, it isn't! The Unreal Engine VR utility dropped, which means that we can basically put VR in any Unreal Engine game we want. And the first thing I immediately thought was Fortnite. Yes, that is a nine-year-old thought of me, but I thought Fortnite. I believed that Fortnite would be the game to do Unreal Engine in. I mean, come on. It's one of the most popular games ever, right? I hope I'm right. So let's go and get into how we do this, how we play it, how I play, how bad I am, and then let's finish this off. Alright, so first thing we want to do is go to the link below and download the UEVR injector from the page. Then after that, you're going to want to open your Fortnite. You can't use modern Fortnite because if you try to inject something, it'll think it's a hack and it'll immediately shut you down and not let you do it. So, use an old Fortnite client like Project Era, Project Nova, EZFN, whatever. And again, this wasn't any Unreal Engine game. Go and open up your Fortnite, make sure the game's open. You can do this with Oculus or Steam VR. And after that, just inject it. You gotta restart with the administrator, obviously. And after that, you can just inject it, and it should work. Now that we know how to do it, we should just go ahead, straight, balls deep, do it. Have fun watching me struggle with Fortnite for the next seven minutes. We'll open the UEF and injector. I don't really know what to expect out of this. What? Hold on, hold on, it's actually doing something. Whoa! No way, bro. What's that? Oh, what? Alright, I'm gonna put the headset on. Cause I need an Oculus view. Let's try this out, I guess. Whoa, just the sheer fact that this works is kind of amazing, honestly. I'm using mouse and keyboard on this, because honestly, I don't feel like hooking up a controller right now, and I don't want to use the Oculus Touch controllers, so yeah. But it, like, all works. Oh, wow, that's trippy. So, like, they only had that part of the game rendered in, because, well, they... I wonder if they did not expect this to happen whenever you, um, do that. Oh, wow. Wow. All right. Um, I already play Era, so, of course, um, I have some stuff. All right, we're going to go in creative mode here. A little lag. Why is the skin, like, so close to me? Like, it's literally right there. Oh, wow. That's fast. The skin's, like, right there. Like, bro, get away from me. So, we're loading into creative mode now. This is just where I can mess around, then we can play a real game. Oh, wow. All right, so I got camera angle adjusted, so now, um... I'm gonna go to my island. So it's like right above my head. So it's almost like I'm in first person. Like I'm almost in first person here, bro. This is crazy. I've been playing around. Not with the VR, just practicing builds and stuff in normal mode. I wanna get like a weapon or something. Hold on. Okay. I want a pump shotgun. Wait, pump shotgun. I want a pistol. I want a sniper. And I want this SMG. Wow, this is crazy. Can we build? I mean, of course we can build. Oh, wow. This just- Oh. Oh, I didn't even know I was stuck in the build. That just- This just feels weird. We're cranking virtual 90s, bro. It's over. Alright. SMG. So I guess the crosshairs work the same. I'm assuming so. Well, we'll have to go in the match and try that out. The shotgun, though. Can I pull, like, one of those little edits? Okay, this is era, so you get, like, no edit on release. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I was messing with a plane. Give me in a plane, please. I want to see. Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah. Snipers. Do oh, that is so trippy. So, snipers do not work. Clearly. This is just more crazy than anything that works. And this is practically plug and play. Again, I just plugged it in. Um, download the application. And it works. You know, I'm surprised I'm not lagging more. I'm recording using Oculus Rift and rendering the game basically twice. And I'm still running at 90 with occasional frame dips. Which I'm a VR chat player, so frame dips aren't really much to me. What? Is this a bitch in my world? Yeah, I bet he doesn't know I'm playing in VR. Oh well, gliding looks pretty funny on this. <laughs> Enough messing around creative. Let's get in a real match and let's see what we're doing here. Here we go, man. Oh wow, that looks cool, bro. What? Oh wow. Got emotes and everything. Holy. Okay, we're waiting for players, but. Whoa, this is- this is actually trippy. Holy. Oh, wow. Tilted? No, we're not land tilted. Salty. 
I want to try to get one kill, but I really suck. I kind of suck at Fortnite anyway. I'm on the keyboard, but I'm in I'm in fucking VR. Like that's gonna make it a lot worse. Oh, minigun. Nah, whatever. Minigun's all right. It just feels weird being just close to it. Uh, I don't know. It's just weird. I gotta try some more um, Unreal Engine games. I'll put some videos, but like, man. I wonder if the crosshair like actually lines up. If it does, that'd be really sick. For some reason, it feels a little bit smoother though when it actually is running good. I think it's because it's 90 hertz and I have a 60 hertz monitor, so like, yeah. There's people over there. Second, I see a person. Let's just. Oh shit. Oh my god. I don't got material, bro. Oh god, the crosshair doesn't line up. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Okay, that was that was me. Really, I got the snowflake one. That felt weird. I don't. Oh wow. I don't know what about it. That's it. Um, I would play more, but I really suck at the game, and also the crosshairs don't line up, so it'd be impossible for me to win, get a kill, do anything like that. I guess that's it for me. I don't really know what to do. I can't get a kill, obviously, because of how just weird all this is, but hey, it's Fortnite in VR, technically, so. Okay, so I didn't realize how much the microphone on the CV1 was clipping. I'll try to do it better next time. I probably should have lowered some stuff, but honestly, I just didn't realize it's my first time recording. So Fortnite VR felt pretty good, honestly. Would I recommend you to do it? If you already have, like, some kind of old Fortnite project, you have a VR headset all hooked up and ready, I'd try it out, you know? It's a it's a fun experience. I'd definitely try it out. Would I play it mainly? No. No. I don't think I'm ever gonna play it again, honestly, other than for, like, video purposes. I don't think I'm gonna, like, sit down on my own time and decide I'm gonna play it. But, hey, it's, a, it's pretty cool, I'd say. And that's Fortnite VR, but, um, hey, I'm the first one to make a video on it. That's not a short, so... If that counts for something. This video is really dog shit though, but hey, it it works. It's a video, technically. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys later. Yeah, yeah, yeah.